What's your story on? Baseball, yours? Basketball, and yours? Football. Huh, all sports stories. It's a sports edition. Hey, a sports center edition of your, your Nightly <laughs> News. Nightly News Sports Center edition. I'm Andrew. I'm Trevor. And I'm Jackson. Today is all sports stories. I'm covering baseball and I've got football. But well, let's get started with basketball. Finally, it is here. We have waited a long six months just to finally start playing. We are excited and ready to play. The most part about the last eight months of no sports is now finally starting again. It's been uh, not being able to hang out with friends and uh, all the players that we play with, it's been hard for us. Yeah. Limited games and no preseason practice. What do you think your players' attitudes have been like this season? I think it's been really good. Um, yes, it's been challenging to kind of get them ready for the season, but I think that they've been very uh, aggressive, and I think their attitudes have been great. They want to continue to get better, uh, get to know each other, and, and play together real well. Uh, it's been a really good season so far, and I'm proud of it. How do you think your players have came out and played this year under all the circumstances of the last year, Coach Winkler? Well, they, they've come out and played really well. They've played hard, played together, have given me great effort, and uh, that's all we can ask in these strange times. Uh, it's not ideal. But it is what it is. We can only control what we can control. And uh, the team is uh, focused on winning a conference championship. And we're getting better. We're peaking at the right time. We've got some big games coming up. And uh, we've got to win them all right now. So uh, the kids uh, have pulled together and are sacrificing to win a conference championship. Wish we had a regional, sectional, and state tournament. But we don't. So we're going to win this conference. Get it done and um, end our season on a very high note. Well, thank you very much. The people that made this season happen, it's been a long year, and uh, good luck to the rest of the sports teams at Fieldcrest in 2021. For your nightly news, this is Jackson. Peace out. They did a great job under the circumstances. They were 12-1 and one in the HYC Conference Champs. Now that basketball is over, it means the football is starting. Well, this year anyways. How is it preparing for the season, knowing you only have two weeks to prepare before your first game? It's definitely different, um, but what makes it great is we have a great group of guys that we would have gone you know, one day of preparing or just straight into a game without preparing because they make it so easy and so fun. So it's out there, and we're you know drawing up plays in the dirt, and we're putting a lot of time in in the classroom beforehand. So we're really working around the clock as coaches, as a team, to – to get ready for the season and put our plays in and just get ready to win some football games. Thank you. It's been a wild ride waiting for football to start, and now we've finally been able to start. So now let's move on to a sport that didn't have a season last year, and that's baseball. It's been a long wait for all baseball players. Let's see what some of them have to say. How anxious are you to be able to play baseball again this year? Oh, I'm very anxious. It's been uh, about a year since we've been out there last, and I just I can't wait to get back out there and play with my guys. Uh, how difficult is it going to be to get prepared this year with this crazy schedule? We're not going to have much time, so it could be kind of difficult, but all of us have been playing together for quite a long time, so I think that'll help. Yeah, thank you. I'm here with Chloe Allen, a senior on the baseball team. And, Chloe, what are you uh, most excited about to be able to play baseball for your senior? Uh, just being able to get on the field again with the uh, people I've been playing with since I was like tw 10 years old. All right, yeah. And in this crazy year, how have you been getting prepared for this season and your next year to play at Carl Sandburg? Uh, we've been doing open gyms at Fieldcrest now for like four weeks, and I have went to a couple of the Carl Sandburg practices in Galesburg. Here's to hoping that the season will be somewhat normal. Well, that's our Sports Center show. Next time, a regular version. So we'll see you with another edition of Your, Your Nightly, Nightly News. News.